It was a wild one here at the RBC Center as NC State takes down Tobacco Road rival and number seven ranked Duke 88-74. Maybe there's something magical about that red jacket Coach Sidney Lowe pulls out when playing the Blue Bloods on Tobacco Road. The magic seemed to work for State when they started the second half leading 41-38 from the break. State would be led by the birthday boy, Tracy Smith, who gave the pack a nine-point lead two minutes into the second half with the layup. Smith, who turned 22 on the night, received help from teammates Dennis Horner, who hits a jumper, and Javi Gonzalez, who hits a dagger three with less than four minutes remaining. All five Wolfpack starters scored in double figures the first time all season, and State fans showed their appreciation by rushing the court when the clock hit 0-0. This one seemed to be a collection of lessons the pack picked up from all those heartbreaking losses. And for the first time all season, State was doing the heartbreaking. The coach Joe told us that. He told us to go out with a little swagger. I mean, just play hard and have some fun. I mean, he told everybody he wanted this to be a good birthday present for me, and they came out and made it happen for me. Who gave you the hat? One of the fans gave me the hat. Yeah, they put it on outside the autograph. Huge. He's the birthday boy. He's a. Uh, He's playing about as hard as he can, and uh, uh, that's all we need out of him. I think it was a little bit of both. I think it was everything, really. I mean, it was a special night tonight. You know, everything was clicking for us. Uh, you know, the dunk got the uh, crowd fired up, got us fired up. That three, you know, I think the three was the dagger. And uh, when you play 35 seconds like that defense, and then that happens, you know, it's just like you know, it blows the wind out of you, kind of. What was going through my mind was um, how hard these, these kids play. Quick flashback to a couple of games that we that we lost, you know, that, that uh, um, didn't think we should have, and just to see them finish it off, even down to the end where I was telling them to move the ball around, they just continued to do it all the way, and just just proud. I was just proud, you know. And, and, I mean, that's it's a big win. It's a, it's a big win for, for our program and for our for our players and for our fans. I, I didn't know they were storm the court. That was <laughs> that was uh, when I turned around after you know shaking there. State now takes this momentum on the road as they head to College Park this Saturday to take on the Maryland Terrapins. I'm Fidel Sasumpa reporting for Palestra.net, the College Network.